The Lord hears me in the day of trouble. The name of the blood of Jacob defend me. Send me help from the sanctuary and turn me out of Zion. Remember all thy offerings and accept thy burnt sacrifice. Grant peace according to thy own heart and fulfill all thy counsel. We will rejoice in thy salvation. And in the name of our God, we will set up our banners. The Lord. Coming down, down, coming down. Oh, when the glory of the Lord is coming down. Oh, when the saints began to pray, and the Lord shall have his way. And the glory of the Lord is coming down.
blood was safe, raise your hands and raise your hallelujah. Raise your hallelujah in the presence of the enemy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I'm going to hand over now to our pastor. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Brother McLeod, you may come now for the testimony. In Jesus' name. Praise the Lord, we just want to look at this as well. Praise the name of Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Just wave your hands and praise the Lord. For God is good and good and good and greatly to be praised. Hallelujah. I want somebody who has something to say about Jesus on this side to just stand and give your testimony. On this side. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. No blood wash want to give a testimony on this side. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord Jesus. Tonight I can join with the psalmist and say, Oh, come, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is that man. Blessed is that girl. Blessed is that woman. Blessed is everyone that trusted in the name of the Lord. God bless you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. I am so glad I've got salvation in time. Church, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Remember me, prior. You, you know, the 
word of God said he said and move baby all ways abounding in the world Jesus and every tough God every fake word you know I come here tonight with and that is from God so feel my strength beloved because I mean when Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Let the saints of God just lift your hands and worship him. For he alone is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. 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 He alone is worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy. You are worthy. Thanks, we give your praise. One more testimony. Hallelujah. 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 I am so glad of God's salvation Thank you, Jesus. on time. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I don't know who's glad tonight. Hallelujah. But it seems to Thank be you, Jesus. tonight. It seems to be all of us glad. <laughs> because we're running behind you, God. Hallelujah. Uh, when you're glad, that's what you're running down our road behind or even run past it. And tonight I'm feeling good knowing that the God that we serve never leave us nor forsake us. And this is a calling. Because I said, I be lifted up. I will do the dry. And all of us that are here tonight, I believe God called us somewhere down the line. That's why we are here. Because you know people on the outside talk to a lot of them outside. But because I never get the calling. Because before I get calling, I never had a pretty close way I got church. I hope that world thinks some real rather moving fans and so church. But when we step in that church and say, Oh my god, and what God called me, I'm going. Now after we go in, one one chooses that from our pants where you are calling your shirt. Until closet full, they look like about two closet no full. <laughs> and we giving God thanks Praise tonight. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. And if you go in St. and actually every church in St. and know we got to keep running behind Jesus. And since I come St. Mary, actually every church know we got to keep running behind Jesus. And I'm not stuck running because Praise Jesus saved me. One more testimony from this side. Praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the Lord, everybody. Bless the Lord. Indeed, I'm a living testimony that the Lord saves, He keeps, and He satisfies. I am so glad I got salvation in time. I gave the Lord my life when I was 10 years old. And I'm way past that right now. And the Lord has been faithful. He has kept me. I am grateful to be kept by God. I am encouraging someone today that God can keep you. He has carried me through high school, university, and I'm here right now, and I have no intention to stop serving the Lord. It's my desire by the grace of God to keep on serving him. God bless you. Come to Jesus right now. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah.
the enemy. Those of you who didn't testify, just stand up and, and raise a praise, raise a praise. Hallelujah. a little bit more again. Amen. And I want to greet also our assistant pastor Eunice Mitchell. Amen. And all the deacons and elders that are here from the various churches, all the saints, and most of all our visiting friends, those who are under the tent, those who are outside of the tent, those who are listening from home, in your car, and those who are online, we're greeting the wonderful name of Jesus Christ. Also want to greet our visiting speaker. Amen. Minister Don, it's such a pleasure to have you here with us. I want to share a brief testimony. And I want to testify, Brother Campbell, to that young man that spoke to you. And I don't know his age, but I remember as a young boy going to church, I had one shirt, one pants, and the shoes that I was wearing is what we call big bread. Because the toe was showing on both sides of the shoe. There was no other shoe that I had. I had to wait on the hand-me-down from my brother. And it didn't reach that time yet for me to be handed down to me. It, things got so bad at that one point in time when my dad got concerned. Told me to stay home. But I didn't want to stay home as young as I would have wanted to be in the house of the Lord. The shirt had an embroidery on the left pocket. And after many days of washing, that embroidery started to ravel out. The pants was a, a striped pants, but the stripe wasn't, was, it wasn't painted stripe, it was sewn in the, in the pants. And after a while, with that brush that we used to use, it became almost pitchy patchy. The road was so hot at times that we wore, wore the shoes on the road because it, it was more tar than that it was asphalt. Just, just to get, to get, get up, 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 But we didn't mind going to the house of the Lord. Also, also we went, went church, church, not knowing when we went, 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 when we went,
Hallelujah, and I live to see the Lord provide for me in such a magnificent way that hallelujah, most of the clothes that I have, I don't buy them. God provided for me. Hallelujah. And it was since last, since last since week, last my sister last called, my me sister and called said, me and said, urgently, send your jacket, send your pants, send your pants, send someone, someone from far, far in, call, 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 call her, tell her, her, tell her, her that they, that they watch me on live stream and my life. I was wearing the same suit over and over and told her, get your jacket, sir. This is the same suit I took a picture of the inner pockets. I took a picture of the pants size. And I said, I don't know when that suit will come. But when I come, I'm going to wear it and rejoice. Because I serve a God who provides. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He may not come when you think. He may not come when you think. He you want to be there. Right he's going to be there. Right he's a provider. Right he's a healer. He's a deliverer. A deliverer. I know I what know. he wants to live in a house. A board house if you please. And the wooden part of the floor crack and wet. And when we were running as children, we had to be careful so we didn't fall through the crack. I know what it is to go to school. Without food, but we were in the house of God. And I know what it is to travel first class in an airplane. Go GSA, go London, go Paris. Hallelujah. West Africa, I cock up my foot and enjoy because when I think of the goodness of God and where He brought me from, my soul cry out. Hallelujah. So come, man. Come. Whether the pants long or short, cut up. Come. Come as you are. And God will take care of you. Amen. At this time, we'll ask Amen Evangelist Lewis, Minister Sherry Lewis, Amen, to come and greet us as the wife of our presbyter. Amen. Praise the Lord again, everybody. Are you feeling happy tonight? Can you stand and just give the Lord a hearty praise? Hallelujah! 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 Praise the Lord! Thank you, Jesus. We are feeling and enjoying the wonderful presence of the Lord Jesus. And I salute him at this time. Praise God. God is truly amazing. Hallelujah. Somebody said, look what the Lord has done. Hallelujah. He healed my body. He touched my mind. He saved me right on time. I'm going to praise his name. Praise the Lord. Tonight I want to greet again Assistant Pastor. Amen, my good friend over there, Sister Mitchell, praise the Lord, her son, amen, Minister Andrew, working and his family working on the side of the vineyard, our musicians are visiting, speaker tonight, amen, Minister Ruel Don, praise God, he's no stranger to us, praise the Lord, and all our wonderful people of God that are here tonight, you look so beautiful. Amen. Praise God. And all our visiting friends, all our friends from this community or this area called friendship. Hallelujah. Friendship with Jesus. Hallelujah. I want to greet my husband as well, Pastor Louis, sitting behind me. Praise the Lord. Friendship with Jesus. Amen. You couldn't find a better friend. And so I'm saying to you tonight, you are the reason why we are here. Hallelujah. And if you will hear his voice tonight, harden not your heart. I pray that you will surrender before it's too late. Jesus is coming. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. At this time, we're going to invite, amen. We, in the United Pentecostal Church of Jamaica, we have a national board, national superintendent, superintendent, we have heads of department. And we have executive presbyter several regions, region four span St. Mary, St. Anne. Have own presbyter, and um, we are having this 10 crew but it began with the leadership of our presbyter. Hallelujah! 
full of our presbyter. At this time, I'd like us to put our hands to Jesus as we welcome Pastor Joseph Lewis, our executive presbyter for Region 4. He's going to come and greet us and he'll introduce our guest speaker. Let's all clap our hands to Jesus as he comes. Thank you, Minister Mitchell. Praise the name of the Lord, everyone. Hallelujah. Can we exalt the name of the Lord Jesus? Can we shout hallelujah? Boy. We aren't about the warming business. Amen. You have hot, hot top. And we are here on a we are here on a serious the people of God as all right to be united to be on one accord for God to show up. Praise the name of the Lord. This is friendship. The people in friendship really need God. They really need God. I don't believe that many of them are friends of God. But God sees them as his friend. But many don't see it. I want to greet Assistant Pastor Andrew Mitchell. Praise the name of the Lord. And Assistant Pastor Eunice Mitchell. Know that sometimes I stand right. Greetings to my wife. Thank God for her. I want to thank God for her hard working. Minister, well done. Praise the name of the Lord. He was just preaching bamboo funeral service. And we say God bless the God. Brother Andrew spoke about somebody getting a suit for him. But you know, the last time I see him was this morning. I believe that might have to ease now tell them increase the size of praise the name of the Lord. Oh hallelujah. But we are here on business, brethren. And the all important name that we are here about is the name of Jesus. Can we shout the name of Jesus? Can we all stand and shout the name of Jesus? Neither is there salvation in any other. For there is none other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. Acts chapter 4 verse 12. None other name. So we are here about the name of Jesus. And we are here very concerned about friendship. Because we need to see the people of friendship. Becoming friends of Jesus. So I want us to shout the name of Jesus one more time. I want us to shout salvation. I want us to shout deliverance. I want us to shout miracles. Hallelujah. I want us to shout revival. We want to get hotter and hottest in this crusade in friendship. God bless you. You may be seated as I recognize the churches present here tonight. And uh, we are here under the banner of the United Pentecostal Church of Jamaica. This is the opening of our Crusade, our 10th crusade. Hallelujah. I hope the next 10th crusade will have to get a bigger 
ten. Two or three tens. And it's done. Amen. So I welcome all God's wonderful people. My wife said you are beautiful. Do you believe that? You are beautiful. Touch somebody and say you are beautiful. We never normally say that men are beautiful, you know. <laughs> but tell them tonight that they are beautiful. Praise the name of the Lord and they better accept it. Amen. So it's a pleasure to have Highgate UPC, the leading church for this crusade. Praise the name of the Lord. Can I get UPC stand and give God a resounding praise? Come on, man. Let the, the atmosphere quake. Hallelujah. Wonderful Jesus. God bless you, I get. Not field. And I'm, I think we are very much in not feel, eh? Is is Linton? Not feel. Can you stand and give God the highest praise? <laughs> Two, three. <laughs> You're waiting on two, three. Praise the name of the Lord. Gail, light in the valley. Oh, wonderful Jesus. Come on, Gail. You're having victory today. Come on, shout a victory praise unto the Lord. One more time. Aleppo. You know how far Aleppo is? My God. Where's Aleppo? Stand Aleppo. Let them see how faithful you are. Coming from down in a valley. My Lord. The other day I was thinking of Aleppo. Down in a valley. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. So Aleppo, give God the best. <laughs> Give God the highest. Thank you very much. Oh, we have light in the valley already. I want to greet Assistant Pastor Mitchell and his wife, family. Praise the name of the Lord. God bless you. And just about everyone, unsaved friends, backsliders, you are the VIPs. And we are here. Because of you. We are traveling from far to be here. Jesus loves you. Because we love your soul. We are here. May we all stand. At this juncture. It's my pleasure to invite. Minister Royal God, Word of God, thus said the Lord. God bless you, Pastor and Presbyter of the United Pentecostal Church of Jamaica, Region 4, Pastor. Joseph, Nathaniel, Lewis, to his beautiful wife, Minister Sherelle, Lewis, to pa assistant pastor, pastor Eunice Mitchell. Not only you struggle with that name, struggle with it 
thank God for our second when the fasting. We start to see each other more often and I start to try me and get it correct most of the time. Minister Andrew Mitchell, one of the warriors of his time, we have been together very often on the road. To the musician, to the brethren that traveled with me from Light in the Valley, UPC, way over in Gale, our church over close to four today, and we start very early. God pour out his spirit in that house upon almost all flesh that was in the house and two souls received the infilling of the Holy Ghost. <laughs> Minister Campbell, the Everton variety, speaks, and Minister Byron Lewis and myself, we did the altar call and the prayer, and God ripped the place. We must make our boast in the Lord, you know. I don't understand how the world of boasts in sin and Christians so calm and quiet in righteousness. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he has done for me, my soul cries out. Hallelujah. Thank God for saving me. And I was a bad, bad, bad boy. But Jesus cleansed me. I was so bad that I was smoking so much weed that he had to speak to my heart two weeks before he saved me. Something said to me, because we are fresh in us. I'm not going to ask you to be seated because we, go, we come to war for this week in righteousness. So, the Lord spake to my heart along the month. He said to me, do you want to live for God? I heard him in my inner ear. It wasn't our devil yet. If you want to live for God, you can begin by take out the airing out of your ear. When I heard the voice of the Lord, I grabbed the ears and forget that it had pain. I plucked the entire thing and the back gun, lucky thing, the back fly off. Yes, I would have lose that ear. And I threw it away and I threw away the piece of gold plated teeth. Them were over cap and I get rid of the chains. Few days later, something said to me, How long can you keep yourself from smokers cliff? I said, until I eat something, ready to eat something. And I start day one. And in the second week, I burn it Tuesday. I didn't burn it Tuesday. I didn't burn it Wednesday. I, well, Wednesday is when he nails me. So I did two weeks and from Monday to Wednesday around 11.30 that day when he saved me. And when he saved me, I owe for seven pounds of weed that I didn't sell. I smoke it. If you're tired, sit. But I don't want you to get ready to be tired for we sang the song all the time. We are not tired yet. Get used to it from here to I am here to preach. Hallelujah. And I won't bo bother you with me. I'm going to talk to us about something that we need to keep in mind. However, that night I hold for seven pounds of weed. And I stopped smoke for two weeks and how much that Sunday. 
on the Tuesday and Wednesday. And he saved me and I never have a crave for neither coke nor ganja again, not once. I don't remember how it tastes. I'd never, I can't recall what the good or the bad weed tastes like. Jesus, wash me. I was an alcoholic and I'm in my 23rd year. Never sip a sip of alcohol down this. I thank God. I thank God. I'm going to invite you to turn your Bibles to the book of Isaiah. Chapter 53, from 1 to around 7. Praise the name of God. Are you there? Who hath believed our report? And to whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? For he shall grow up before him as a tender and as a root out of a dry ground. He had no form nor comeliness. And when we shall see him, there is no beauty that we should desire him. He is despised and rejected, a man of men, a man of sorrow, acquainted with grief. And he hid as it were our face is from him. He was despised and we esteem him not. Surely he had borne our grief and carry our sorrow. Yet we did esteem him stricken, smitten of God and afflicted. But he was wounded for our transgression. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And with his stripes we are healed. All he like sheep have gone astray. We have turned everyone to his own own way and the Lord had laid on him the iniquity of us all. He was oppressed and he was afflicted yet he opened not his mouth. He is brought as a lamb to the slaughter and as a sheep before his share is dumb, so he opened not his mouth. Praise the name of the Lord. In these few minutes, I know I heard from the Lord. I was in bamboo just for two purposes for a funeral. And just to stay in the house of the Lord for a while. Because I had to preach there yesterday. As pastor said. And I have to come here tonight. And I just want to be in the house of the Lord. Where I would be by myself. And I heard him the first time I went there. On Thursday night. Jesus is the best thing. That ever Happen to me. Tell your neighbor. Jesus. Is the best. Thing. That ever. Happened to me. You may be seated. I have been noticing. The organization. The movement in which I'm a part of. 
And I've been preaching almost 29 years without stop. Hallelujah. But for the past maybe 10 years, Pastor Lewis, I don't know where you, our superior officers, go to get the team yearly from God. But I strongly believe in this last 10 years, God has been in the midst of the team that he gave to all of you, sir. And sisters, just God's minister. And this one, I believe, we don't get the message yet that God gave us to really Preach this one at it hard. I believe we're just warming up in preaching. I believe we need to get down a little bit deeper in preaching Jesus. Because I'm here to tell you if I don't tell you anything else for the rest of the night. Without Jesus, you're lost. I come to tell friendship if Jesus is not in your life, Hell can miss you. The only way we can redeem is through the name of Jesus. And his blood is what set us free by cleansing us from all sin. When he died, he removed the purpose of the priest. And the high priest. The priest's job was. Or one of them. To prepare. The heifer. And the outside. To draw that heifer. Against that animal will. Pull it. Take the blood. In a basin. Into the gate or the door of the temple. And the high priest would take that basin with the blood. And offer it to almighty God. As an atonement for the sins of the people. But in that for a long time. Had been used by the Israelite. But the blood of animal was not enough. God had the first Adam that sin that caused mess upon every other human kind. And the first Adam failed. And there could not be found another man worthy to take the sins of man. But the mighty God chose to redeem man once and for all. And he came to earth. He found a virgin by the name of Mary. She was a chaste virgin, a holy young woman. He found a man by the name of Joseph, one who lived a holy life. One in whom genealogy would have been significant for Jesus Christ to come true. And God saw it fit to robe himself in flesh. That he could uh, die once and for all. To redeem man from their sins. Who had believed our report. 
Our report is in Jesus Christ. No other foundation can any man lay but that which was laid by Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is the only way. Acts 4 12 said, Don't check any other way. For neither is there salvation in any other. For there is none had a given among men whereby we must be saved. But through those days men brought lamb, some brought bullocks, some brought turtle dove according to the level and the cruelty of their sins. But it was temporary for it could not last for more than a year. So every year, they have to do the same thing again. Over and over. Because the blood of animal was not efficient. So every year, animals die. But finally, finally, I heard the New Testament Say, unto us is born this day. This day a child is born. Unto us a child is born. Unto us a son is given. Oh, Pentecostal, you don't long up. And the government. Shall be upon his shoulder. I heard Saint Matthew said. His name shall be called. Emmanuel. Interpreted God with us. This same Jesus. Is not one of the gods. He is God. Jesus Christ is Lord. He is Savior. John. I'm kind of forcing it in upon the one that's a sweet me. John said in John chapter 1. That without Jesus, Kizi, there is nothing made that were made. This same Jesus, the one who was crucified. Come on, no man. They nailed him to the cross. He was bruised. For us. He paid the ultimate price. He came lowly. God out of heaven came lowly. That lowly men can rise high and get up. He was his mother. Was riding around on a donkey. Get down to a manger. Gave birth to him. He humbled himself. Because he came for one purpose. That no matter how you sin ugly. No matter how you sin dirty. No matter what lifestyle you were living. That Jesus is the only remedy. The topic and I have to emphasize on it. Because that's what he sent me to speak on. Jesus is the best thing. That ever happened. To me. Everyone here can testify tonight of our past. 
And some of our past was sweet. Sin sweet, man. The end of sin is dead. If you talk about sin, is sweet. If before God saved me, when I was a DJ, I will get up on the highest stage and jump in the crowd. I didn't care if me break a leg, but me feel good. Whether you catch me or me drop, because I feel good. I could have jumped almost as high as Tiger. I burn fire as Capleton. Fire am in his stone. But we came here tonight to burn a fire. And let's keep it. Unless Mr. Bailey get this fire, him no no fire. For this fire, when it when it hit you, when it burn you, it no make you sick. It make you heal. It make you deliver. It make you dance. It make you shout. And when you finish party eh, in Jesus, you get up tomorrow morning feel better. But God Almighty. I heard pastor said, we now leave it till tomorrow. We are nearly tonight. But what if tonight is the last night? We came, I came here, and in a few minutes, when I get down to it, demons will shut up by the power of Jesus tonight. Because I'm about to show us there is power. There is power. In the name of Jesus. And Jesus is the best thing that ever happened to me. So he came as a baby. And then by age 12, we heard loss of him. When he went in talking to doctors, lawyers, and for that, we hear nothing much about him for a good while, a few years. The Bible said he went off to learn what we are going to go through. Hallelujah. I thank God that I serve a God who he was just raw power. I tension, I definition God. The Bible tell me how high he was before he became or he took on flesh because God no became man. God just put on the body and flesh so that he can get down to some stuff that we get down. But when he was the attention God, the Bible told me that there was a man by the name of Joseph. And Joseph had a dream. And his dream take him from trouble with his father, trouble with his brothers, cast down in a pit. I come to tell anointed people, you can't run from trouble. We are troublemakers. Pastor Lewis, if you are not a troublemaker, you are not a one God. Apostolic. Tongue talking, holy roller, born again, believer. I am a troublemaker. I came in friendship not to make friends just like that. My way of making friends is to make trouble. The Bible said, when this Jesus, I remember where I stopped coming back. The Bible said when this Jesus passed the man in the, get to the man in the tomb, the demons cry out. Without Jesus say a word. 
We came here, demons going to cry out. We come to kick and trample. Serpent, scorpion. We are sons of God. We are children of the most high God. The righteous God is living in me. Once I was just flesh. But in 1996, a Wednesday night, Pastor Armstrong was preaching in Gale. And something got a hold on me. And I start to speak in another language. And from that day, the spirit of God dwell in me. You can't free the noise and have God. For we have a God. That when he's about to make noise, man said, speak to him, Moses. Tell him no longer speak to us. For while God put men in a safe place, that they would not die when they came to his raw power. I think I forget where I was. They came and God said, if you pass out of friendship, you're going to die. And the safe place that God placed man was not safe for man. For the Bible said when God began to speak to Moses, the hypocrite, the demon men cry out, no, we can't take it. It was driving their brain out for the power of a hungry God. A raw, hungry God. So the Bible said Joseph went into Egypt. And Joseph, while he was down into Egypt. There was a need for somebody who have vision. The apostolic church is a church of transformation. I wonder if I come to the one God house tonight. We are people who know more than just what we hear. The Bible said Joseph heard from God. Because there were two men with him in prison. One was a butler. And the other was a baker. And they both have dreams. And they need an interpreter. And now they told the dream to Joseph. And Joseph gave the interpretation. And it was correct as a book. And the other, when he was leaving, he gave Joseph an assurance. He said, when me go up, then no worry, brother, brother. Jenna, Jenna, no worry about that thing. You see me? Me go up, then me go tell the king about you. That's why we don't go to a place and don't tell people you have to repent of your sin. And baptize in the name of Jesus Christ. And receive the infilling of the Holy Ghost. Backed up with a godly and a sober life. In this present world. For you have some people they promise you. But they can't fulfill it. So he went up and he kept it for two years as a state secret. But the day come when the king had a dream. I come to tell some persons who oh God have been speaking to your heart. Speaking to you in vision. You hear the voice of God calling you. And you are wrapped up in your association. And try to keep it down. This week is not a week to conceal anything in the name of Jesus Christ let the power of God burst into friendship that sinners will repent and turn 
the guy promised the prophet that I will speak of you when I get up there. But for two years, he never speak a word about the young man. But when he heard that the king was wroth, the Bible said that this man catch what we call is freed. He had fear come up on him. And there is somehow God never forget one of his people. Yeah. Cannot tell Pentecostal no matter how your part look dark. My God who is Jesus Christ had not forgotten you. He know where you are. He know our situation. Good God he knows our condition. The Bible said Joseph was left there but now he came by at request. I come to tell somebody is the God of a need for you. God sent us with an at request. God called you for your purpose beginning tonight. Hallelujah to God. The Bible said he said I know a young man. When I was in prison, when you sent me away, when I was in the prison, I met this man. And when the king said to him, go fetch him, bring him to me, they brought him up unto the king. And the king said, I had a dream. But everybody else, yes, so can interpret. Tell somebody the church of Jesus Christ will not be left without an interpreter. Will not be left without somebody who have vision. This apostolic church is the high and the mouthpiece of God. I thought I was in a one God apostolic meeting tonight. The Bible said that this guy give the dream and the interpretation of the dream. He said, oh king, live forever. You see king, the seven fat cow you saw. Meaning there will be seven years of plenty. But the next version of your dream. That you saw seven maga cow came up and hit the seven fat cow. Mean after the seven year of plenty, there are gonna be seven year of famine. But if you plant enough corn, if you do what right, oh God Almighty, we come to tell some people in friendship. Darkness is covering this hurt. But if you turn it over to Jesus. Come on musician. Come on church. Come on young people. If you turn it over to Jesus. Everything got to be all right. It got to be all right. Oh change is coming. Joy is coming. Peace is coming. The king said not only that. Uh, I'm going to bless you. I'm giving you the position. With a new robe. You see. When the devil believed. Let me tell you. When you're in sin and the devil messed up your first coat. The devil not do nothing yet. Touch, 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 touch somebody and tell them beside you. God no give you one quote. He give us many quote. With many quote. Because his father gave him a quote that was pretty. Until today we name all flowers of it. Joseph quote. But that one was messed up. Cut up. And deep in blood. I come to tell somebody. No matter how the enemy chop you up. Mash you up. Stretch you high. Turn you into lunatic and zombie. 
and cook like I used to take. Jesus, this the best thing that ever happened. One God people, I said, Jesus is the best thing that ever happened. It is not Father. It is not Son. It is not Holy Ghost. Those three are title. I am a father. I am a son. And I am a grandfather. It make me just rule the white done. That's my name. I'm not troubling you. But I trouble you. But I have to trouble you. Father, son, and Holy Ghost are half -ices. That the one God all you will not see on the day when he return three gods for I heard him said I am one and I know not another Jesus is the name of the father of when the back and jump at the place. Jesus is the name of the son Jesus is the name of the Holy Ghost and all those three are one. You shall see one God coming in the sky. His name is Jesus. And it's one throne. And you the go woman sit and your wife and your wife sit and the kids. If it is one God, it's one throne. How three God is going to come sit and one throne. It is Jesus alone. You only can make it through Jesus. Jesus is the best thing that ever happened. I feel the glory of God. When you find Jesus, you find it all. When you get through the blood, Sister Mitchell, no harm. No harm. No weapon. Hey ho, Pentecost. Hey ho, Pentecost. The battle is not yours. The battle is the Lord. And if we hold our peace, then the Lord shall fight our battle. And we shall have victory. Tell your neighbor, time to war. The best thing. Jesus is the best thing that ever happened to me. I want to get down to where I get in the landing mode of this message. The Bible said that this Joseph risen from falling. God is about to lift up some folks who are falling. You see what the devil don't know. And I thank God the devil is not bright as any one of us. I thank God we are we and the devil no equal. For every living person here have a hope in God. The devil no hang on. He's a loser. That don't rise up against God. And was kicked out by Michael. So I don't forget where I'm coming from. His raw power came. To Moses. So Joseph. Rise up. And he was. The big thing. But the Bible said. After the death. Of Joseph. Raise up. Another Pharaoh. Who know not Joseph. And his slave. The people of God in bondage. You are some slave with in other place here tonight. God send the church to free you. I say God send the church to lose you. For 430 years, evangelists, Pharaoh treat them with disdain. He abuse them. They discombobulate them. When they came to sixth stage, they just get 
them away. But there rise a time. For God had promised the Hebrew. That he's going to send a deliverer. God promised Saint Mary. That I'm going to send a church. God promised friendship. That I shall turn your city upside down. The Bible said. But God. My God. Make a promise. That I will send a deliverer. And into that very time. A deliverer came. But because of time, me I go take him from baby now and gonna lift him a little higher. The woman have given birth to a son. And now the son, the God of their salvation said, hide him. For a while. But after three months, God said to the woman, you can't hide him anymore. God have some people into friendship. The devil can't hide you no more. He been whipping you long enough. But the power of the most high God shall rise up in this building. Beginning tonight, Sunday night. I come to tell somebody you shall be delivered. You shall be healed. You shall be saved. You shall quit your habit. You shall quit your addiction. You shall quit sin. Oh God. You shall be forgiven if you repent. The Bible said that in the third month, he anoint the woman and give the woman a flimsy only God can do what God do and it's right. Have you ever looked on some things where God do and in your human intelligence is madness? Both of you, I know you a long time. You're all word teachers in the classroom. First thing, look at God maths. Look at his square root. God's square root to maths now look like for you. He said, one shall trace a thousand. You're a teacher, you're, you're a teacher yourself. But two shall, oh, you get two to chase 10,000, Kizzy. When one only trace a thousand. Well, God do it there again. He use a submergible to become a floatable. He use a basket and put in the water called the river Nile. That have crocodile. That have python and water mattis. That have all type of killing carnivoric creature. And he placed he place the boy using some water salables. Some bulrush. Some little shove. To cock the basket with the hole. But when God say live. Nobody can kill you. God said, Let go the basket. Time some basket. I go let go tonight. Some basket will seem like you did make me sing. And your name has gone away. And your name has come to nothing. God sent the Pentecostal church to light a spiritual fire. Capleton fire come like matches tonight. This is the power of the most high God. Be healed. Be delivered. Be set free. I come to you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I come to tell you it's the best thing. The best, 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 best thing that ever happened to me. Somebody said he healed my body. Stand up little church. Turn around. God can feel it. He touched my mind. He saved me just in time. God, God is the best thing that ever happened. And the basket will make me sink. Start afloat. And when 
can't get all this song now. We make, we, make, we make the world and make money. And we pour out of what God gave righteous people. You see, see that's where that the song come from. Float like a boat. I say you wouldn't know that song. The younger people know me at all. You see what the first boat float? A God make it. He make it with something we make for sink. And the Bible said the Pharaoh's daughter was somewhere at the beautiful part of the Nile. And she heard the crying of a baby. And then God put compassion in her heart. And God make the woman when never pregnant yet. Go draw the baby out of the water and call his name Moses. For I draw him out of the water. This is my baby. And if you think that was insomnia, if you think that was schizophrenia, if you think that was madness, watch madness. Nobody in a while ago. The Bible said the Pharaoh that was hunting the, 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 the promised seed to kill him. I've killed 10,000 of 10,000. But when the boy Moses get into his house, the fool down him house, take up the baby that he want to kill and singing alibi. Granddaddy, ye ding ding. Granddad boy, sir. Granddaddy, ye ding ding. Moses, I promise you that any man just think of touching you in this kingdom. I him want kill. I tell you, when God takes something, he turn it upside down. The butcher hunting the boy and have the boy a promise. Granddad baby, sir. Granddaddy a ding ding and couldn't kill him. I come to tell some apostoli cancer can't kill you. Let me lock the book. Huh? You can't dead tell God say so. COVID couldn't kill us, for it wasn't his will that we die in COVID. May God bless the dead of the righteous the life, the soul of the righteous that died in God in COVID but COVID couldn't kill us for God of us to be here tonight to preach the gospel of his amazing grace I want to wrap up for I come to tell somebody that when Jesus let me finish Moses Moses came and he growed up. And for a while, he did not know his purpose. Like many people in a friendship, you still a climb up from the pool in a the go-go club. Pastor warned them for I will preach hard. I say you're still around the sauna. Say you're a selector. You still have five husbands. And the one where you have are no few. But Jesus paid it all. All to him, I hope. Sin have left a crimson stain. But he will wash them white as snow. Maybe be a bit dopey calling your name. For your other pregnancy that you never want to carry. And people call your name, call your cemetery. But when the hand of Jesus get on you. No matter what you have been through, no matter where you were, they see a, a crimson stream of blood. It flows from Calvary. It waves until it reaches uh, the throne of God. And it is sweeping all over me. Tonight, uh, the blood prevail. The blood of the living power to save is here tonight is the best thing that ever happened to me the bible said 
Now what time to kill? Now what time to draw blood, Pastor Luz? I told you before. Anything me preach, it a fee in the Bible. Me no, me no, me no, me no hypothetic. Bible. The Bible said, the boy grew up. And all of a sudden, he start to have conviction. If you're a sinner here tonight, shout, Lord, grant me. If you are not baptized in Jesus' name. Because people don't call people sinner again, you know. We are some pretty name I call sinner. Friends. God says sin. Oh, and unsaved friends. Thank you, Pastor. Unsaved friend. Not no go so. Either you're righteous or you're filthy. Sinner. Old dog. Squalawa. Squammy. Lost. From the commonwealth of righteousness. But there is a God here tonight. That can turn your life around. It's the best thing that ever happened to me. And closing. The Bible said. That now. The conviction was upon him. And the anointing come upon him. Can the church just shout anointing? Come upon us. Musician, get on those keys. Anointing. Fall upon us. Let me feel your power. Your anointing every hour. Let your power come down on me. Let, come on, where are the Pentecostal warriors? Let me walk in every day in your special way. Knowing that is your power that set me free. Somebody shout anointing. Somebody shout sweet. Sweet. Stand up man. Sweet. Anointing. Pouring out. Highland wine. All over me. The Bible said. Conviction came upon Moses. And he saw. Baca. The great terrorist. From Goshen. You know, if you read, you know, but, hello, Pastor. Another thing we have to go introduce back in us, trust back in our church. A serious Bible read. Back at the great. Me never go Bible school. I go to fasting. I'm a product of fasting. I'm a product of Bible study. I'm a product of prayer service. And no theologist can run up in me. For I'm a godologist. I get my revelation from the spirit of God directly. The Bible say God came upon him and saw Baca beating to his light and the purpose come immediately and he choked back to death because the king feed him well educate him well some things where you have out there in a sin God ready for you now to come use them in the church we need some of them engineer from stone love you ever hear stone love a play and a squeak you madam We need them in the church now for the purpose of God. They are needed now. That's the reason we are here. Not to make friend at friendship. To bring sinner to righteousness. And then we can become friend of God. And have fellowship with Jesus. For it's the best thing that ever happened to us. And the Bible said he killed Baca. And then he was 40 at the time and he ran away. Some of your backslide. And you run away. But God want you to know. You see them four or five redhead children you get out there in a fornication. You need to come make six. And if the man good enough or the woman good enough that has seven. You baptized already. Ima did sinner. 
and the five children that are six. You left yourself alone, but you have come back to the heart of worship with six more candidates where you never leave with go to sin. At time we start to turn the, 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 the devil mess for God righteousness. You can't stay out there no longer. I talk about me a backslide up. Backslide where? Slide forward. A closing now. The Bible said. There was a switch. He went up. At age 80. In Exodus. Chapter 3. 4 there. And he went up for he heard from a woman who was the daughter of the sheik of Midian. And he found a woman which was not an Israelite or a Hebrew woman. But she taught him about the power of the living God. I'm closing right here. And the woman taught him, she said to him, there is but one God we heard. But he is an unknown God. But we know he exists. For every time this God appear on Mount Sinai. His power and his glory come down on Mount Sinai. And the mountain tremble. And the blood cloud on blood red and no man ever dare to bend to enter over that mountain he said if there is an unknown God today I have to know him and he get up from him woman pray for me some of you are going to get up from who you believe I miss a right I miss right and what tie you down? And what tie you up? Some of you have got chewed on your ganja tonight. Some of you have got. He said if there is an unknown God. That is doing these visible things. I want to know him. And I'm going up on the high mountain. And the Bible said this Moses at 80 years old journey up and he saw something that happened to you and I. Now it is not unique today to us. But Pastor Mitchell, it was unique to them. For the spirit of God came down on a tree and he saw fire. Burning on a tree. And the tree was not consumed. And something said draw closer. I said there is a fire in here. I said there is a fire in here. And it is on many trees. And we are got to light up. Until some sinners see the glory. And feel the glory. Of the most high God. I talked to somebody tonight. I said the Bible said Moses use the tree. How it was burning with fire and was not consumed. But when he bent her to enter close. He heard for the first time in his ears. Moses. Moses. Moses, take off thy shoes for the place that you are standing is holy ground. Take off thy shoes for the place where you are standing is holy ground. Yeah, Lord. And he spake to him there. Now it brought me back to the final baby. You thought I forget about that unto us as child is born. Unto us as son is given. Anybody who know me know I have the brain of an elephant. 
And the Bible said, who art? Believe our report. This report said, I am his. This report said, I can do all things to Christ that strengthened me. This report said, he is my healer. This report said, he is my savior. And this little baby called Jesus, Emmanuel, that shall share his people. He came and he growed up and his father died and he buried him. But when he get up two weeks later in St. John chapter 2, his mother was with him for his father was dead and buried. But now he has something for he is the bridegroom and no bridegroom. Watch the bride suffer. If you are baptized in Jesus name and filled with your Holy Ghost, you shouldn't treat your wife bad. You shouldn't treat your husband bad. You shouldn't treat nobody bad. For the Bible said our God, he also the bridegroom and he went up to Canaan and there was a wedding Pastor Lewis uh, and his mother heard they were complaining. Something happened there in theology. Something happened, but in Godology, I find it out. The Hebrew, uh, the Jews, uh, if there is any blood, according to Leviticus chapter 15, or anything pursuing out of the body of the individual, they are unclean. So what's to ever happen? in Kenyan. That wedding could not go on the day he planned. And you have to have enough food and enough wine to keep the guests. But when the food run out, good God, I'm alone here. When the food run out, when the wine run out, when the music run out, we still have Jesus. For Jesus is the best thing that ever happened to me. And the good man, Jesus, Right at Canaan, his mother says, their wine run out and he did not rude. He was not facetious. It was a great name to call a woman back then. He said to his mother, woman, what must I do about this? This mother Mary said, what's to ever he say, do it. Whatsoever Jesus said tonight, do it. I come to lose this place for the first night in Jesus. I can't do it by myself. But the power of the living God that Moses saw up on a tree and was astonished. I'm back to help you. It is in you and I tonight. And people still looking at us as normal. When you see me, you see Jesus. For I'm a representative of him. And his spirit dwelleth in me. Good God Almighty help me. And the Bible said, he told them, fill up this pot. And immediately turn water into wine. This Jesus Christ of Nazareth is not just the son of God. He's God himself. Colossians said, the fullness of the Godhead dwelleth in him bodily. He found himself in the farm of a man and sought it not robbery to be equal with God. Equal is the same. Jesus Christ is God. He that have made us and it's not we of ourselves. And then he get down to the cross and they nailed him. Somebody said, oh, you forget the text. No, I leave it for last. And the Bible said he was wounded for our transgression. Good God, he was bruised for our iniquity. Where are the hands save the sinners? Stand up. Sit down, church, a little. You are here and you are not baptized in Jesus' name. I beg of you, I'm not bullying you, but could you just stand or stick your hand up? Can you just step forward? Just step out in there until God move. It's going to move. It's going to move. I'm, I can tell you that. I guarantee you. Hallelujah. The Bible said he came 
down and he was betrayed. He was denied. And they brought him before Pontius Pilate. And Pilate said, I found no fault in him. You go in St. John 18 there. And down. And the Bible said that when he was betrayed and denied, they dragged him away. They brought him down to a place called Golgotha. And they nailed him in his hands. They nailed him in his feet. They wrapped a crown of thorn and put it around his head. But I thank God they did that. A soldier who didn't wash his face from morning because nine o'clock would have been his change from guard and spat in his face. He did it for you and I. So that's why when he said, if somebody slap you on the right side, I'm closing, turn the other cheek for Jesus did it. Somebody said he paid it. All the Bible said in close that they brought him and the soldier pushed his sword through his side and blood and water came from his side. His blood that prevailed today, his blood that healed today, is that same blood drying up your cancer? Is that same blood taking your blood sugar away? Is that same blood make demon tremble? They wound him. They pierce him. And the Bible said there was no beauty in him that they should desire him. But he was wounded for my transgression. He was bruised for my iniquity. The chastisement of our peace was upon him and with his stripes we are healed. Any sickness you have, jump up and said, I am healed. In the name of Jesus, I command cancer to be healed. I command HIV to be healed. I command blindness, blind eyes to restore. This is Pentecost. This is the power of the God I tell you about. Good God Almighty. You're drying up. Ah, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, demon tremble, demon tremble, shut shut up, shut up, shut I feel the glory. Get out of those seats now. Time over. Oh, 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 oh. The Bible said when they took the crown of thorn. What's to ever is in your cranium. If a brain cancer in your head, the blood is in your head. If your high nerves get bad, the blood in your high. He paid it all at Calvary. His name is Jesus. He died for us. And he's the only one that can save us. Jesus is the best thing that ever happened. Can you just step out and step towards a man over the mic? I don't conduct when I preach. Step out. Come, ladies. Come back sliders. Rum man come. Cause some of you are boost boy, you are rum man and you're drunk as you drink the first one. And make one bag of nice. God save we when I drink them by the quart. Jesus. Who's gonna wrap me up? They coming in. 
Church, get up and stand up. And what make the church get in so quiet? Demons in here where we have to go cast out and the church are quiet. Allah shatata in the name of Jesus, you shall enter in the gates as of tonight with thanksgiving. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. the blood. That run from his side. When you have the cramp. When you are bleeding. Profusely. When your menstrual. Become a disorder. And you are having overflow. And the doctor can't help you. Your blood drying up here tonight. Jesus. Is the best thing. Come church from where you are. Look at people coming. He is the Father. He is the Son. He is the Holy Ghost. Where is Pastor? Who got to wrap me up? Good God. Hallelujah. 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 Come on. Church, let's worship the Lord. Oh, there are souls who are desperate for God. They are hungry. They are thirsty. Oh, they are greatly in need of salvation. Holy God. Holy God. The healer is here. Oh, many are being deformed and disfigured oh, by the old adversary, by the old serpent. Oh, but with his stripes we are healed. Just plead the blood of Jesus, the precious blood of Jesus. Holy God, holy God, hallelujah. We need some more prayer warriors. Oh. Touch them, Lord. Oh, touch them, Jesus. Touch them, Jesus. Deliver them, Lord. Oh, from the power of sin, from the powers of darkness, hallelujah, hallelujah, come church, worship God, oh, hallelujah, oh, let us come nearer, hallelujah, let us come down, oh, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we speak deliverance now. We speak healing now. We speak salvation in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, sinners come. Oh, hallelujah. Sinners come and be converted tonight. Let the backsliders come. Oh, hallelujah. Coming home, coming home. Oh, never more to roam. Open wide the arms of love. Now I'm coming home. Yes, church. Oh, keep worship alive. Oh, Koshanda. Yes, yes. All you need to do, oh, is to be broken and contrite. Oh, repentance is about you making a right about turn. A turn completely from sin. Oh, from your old sinful ways and deeds and habits, practices. Oh, hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. I'm broken and a contrite heart. Oh, God will not despise. Oh, Holy God, only believe. Only believe all things are possible. Oh, you're here at the right time. Oh, hallelujah for the right purpose. Oh, let the purpose of the Almighty God be fulfilled in your life. Be God's purpose tonight. Oh, hallelujah by a transformed life. Ebo Yes, yes, oh yes, somebody, oh, is reaching out, somebody is greatly in need of Jesus, oh, in need that complete touch, hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus paid it all. We need some prayer warriors. Gee. We need some intercessors. Hallelujah. Oh, oh.
church let us worship God let the church worship oh hallelujah let's come together and worship the Lord oh let's come together and intercede on their behalf somebody needs the Lord tonight somebody needs deliverance from sin oh from the powers of darkness Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. Sweet Holy Spirit, sweet heavenly
of speaking in other tongues as the spirit gives utterance can we believe God for them tonight no one he can push give you peace yes. you cannot understand oh, the word is in your mouth no one can bind your wounds just with praise, nails just, just praise him. give God no praise no one can Hallelujah. You like Jesus can. Just give God praise. No give God one the can praise. touch you like yes, Jesus can. Yes, yes. Jesus. No one oh, can touch you. Yeah, cannot I'm understand. Come on. No one You cannot oh, understand. No touch. one can buy oh, yes. you with this oh, No one can touch you like Jesus can. No one. No one can, can touch, touch you like Jesus can. Oh, no one can give you. You cannot understand. No one can bind your wounds with nails or hands. No one can touch you like Jesus can. No one can touch you. Can touch you like Jesus Jesus can. No one can give you peace. You cannot understand. Oh, we're in need of your touch. One no one time, can find your wounds. We are in need of a fresh touch. Of Jesus. A fresh touch. 
touch no you. No one can touch you like Jesus can. When Jesus comes, the tempter's power is broken. When Jesus comes, all tears are wiped away. He takes the gloom and fills the heart with glory. Come on, let's sing for all is Come on, let's worship the Lord when Jesus comes to stay. Oh, when Jesus comes, the tempter's power is broken. When Jesus comes, all tears are wiped. And with glory, let's worship the Lord till all is changed. Just come to stay. Come on, let's sing and worship God. When Jesus comes, the tempted stars. Hallelujah! Oh, the tempter's power must be broken tonight. Or wiped away. Shall we all stand when Jesus comes? The tempter's heart is broken. When Jesus comes, all tears are wiped away. He takes the gloom. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord, before you are some precious souls. Oh, God, and also in the community of friendship, there are souls not present here tonight. God, but they are greatly in need of you. Their greatest need tonight, Lord, is the need of salvation. 
the need of deliverance from sin, from the darkness, the powers of the darkness of this world. Oh, shut up. Wickedness in high places. Akoshata. Principalities and powers. Rulers of the darkness of this world. Spiritual wickedness in high places. Deliver them, Jesus. Akoshata. Set them free, Lord. For whom the sun set free is free indeed. Release these prisoners of sin tonight. Oh God, liberate them. Liberate them from sin slavery. Break the chains. Break the shackles. Loose them, Jesus. Loose the captives tonight. Set the captives free, Almighty God. By the power of the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, we break these chains tonight. In no other name but the name of Jesus. We come against the demons of darkness. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, that are oh, suffocating the lives of these people. Lord God Almighty in the name of Jesus oh we cast them out oh we cast them into outer darkness where they belong oh, we release the prisoners a koshatai of sin. Let them be free tonight. Oh, free. Oh, to worship you. Free to praise your name. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, free to shout deliverance. Hallelujah. Oh, holy God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, the precious blood of Jesus. Oh, the precious blood of Jesus. Come on, just worship God. Oh, there's a beautiful presence of the Lord here tonight. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, hallelujah. Hey, it's rain, but it's rain. It's rain. Oh, I know it's rain. Praise God. My doubts are settled. And I know. Yes, I know. I know. This Come on, sing if you believe it. It's free. Hallelujah. It's, it's free. free. The power of the Almighty God is real. The power of Jesus is real. The Holy Ghost is real. Miracles are real. Akoshatai. Deliverance is real. It's real. Yes, it's real.
praise God. Come on, praise God. Praise your, praise your Savior. Praise your deliverer. Ah, Lord, my Shatter. I know, I know, I know. We know. He's real. Oh, Jesus is real. Yes, He's real. He's real. Oh. My doubts are set. Glory! Jesus is real. Yes, he is real. He's real. Oh, I Praise God, my doubts are set. Glory! And I know, yes I know, I know. It's oh yes, yes is rain. Glory is rain. Oh. Praise God. Can we lift our hearts, our hearts to heaven? Oh, and sing that our God is real, that his salvation is real, his miracles are real. Oh, yes, yes, it's real. It's real. Oh. And I know, Glory. I know, it's real. Yes, he's real. But it's real. Yes, my God is real. It's real. Glory. I know, it's real. And I know, Holy God. I know, yes, I know, it's real. Oh, yes, yes, it's it's real. real. yes, it's real. Yes, it's real. It is the Holy real. Ghost Sweet. 
with stammering lips, with stammering lips, with stammering lips, and another tongue in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Jesus. Hallelujah, yes. hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, young lady. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Tonight is your night. Thank you, Jesus. God is healing you. Thank you, Jesus. Both your mind, hallelujah. your soul, hallelujah. and your body you is purging you tonight. You are Sicknesses me. are leaving your body. Hallelujah. And the Jesus. spirit of the living God shall come upon Thank you. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And you shall Thank speak. You, Jesus. With new tongue. With new tongue. Stammering lips. Stammering lips. Stammering lips. And another tongue. Stammer. Stammering lips. And another tongue. Right now. From your belly. From your belly. From your belly. From your belly. Shall flow. Rivers. Rivers. Of living water. Glory to God. I wish the church would have come by faith tonight. Jesus. 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 Hallelujah! Worship, church. Worship. 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 It must happen in here. It must come to pass. Yes, 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 yes. My doubt are set good. And, and I know. I know. What a God, what a God. Yes, 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 open your mouth. Talk to him, he's healing, he's saving, he's fixing. My doubt, I said so. And I know, yes, he's healing tonight. Cancer is leaving this room. Diabetes is leaving the room. God yes, is healing. He's, real. he's saving. He's saving. He's, real. he's saving. Come on, young woman. He's working on you. He's working on you. God is working on you. He's cleaning you up. Don't quit. Don't quit. Press down tonight. Press down tonight. Yes, Lord. Yes, it's real. Yes. Yes. It's real. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes. I know. Yes. Yes. It's real. Be loose. Be loose. Praise God. God. My doubts are settled. And I Tonight is the night. And I know you say yes to the Lord. I you say yes to the Lord. Tonight is the night. Is you say yes, Lord. I willing and I know to follow you all the days of my life. Yes, yes, yes. 
is your night of surrender. But it's real. Yes. It's real. Are you baptized in oh, Jesus' name? I know. Are you ready to be baptized in Jesus' name? We believe you tonight. We believe you tonight. Yes, Lord. Let some traps now fall on these. Lord, I hear of showers of blessing. Showers of blessing. My soul refreshing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Let's all stand together. And if Jesus starry, we're going to be here tomorrow night. And for those in the community, we will have persons here in the day. If you want to come for prayer, for counseling, for Bible study, come at your convenience. Someone will be here to talk with you, to pray with you. I want to give God thanks. For tonight, thanks for Sister Martin for leading us into worship, Sister McCoy, Amen, and the team of musicians, technicians, electricians, and the praise singers, and all the worshipers, and all the saints. And um, I know it's just the first night, but I really want to express sincere thanks to the deacons and the saints. From Nutfield, Deacon Ramata, Deacon Hibbert, Sin and Juno, Deacon Carter and the team that came. Amen and work assiduous with assistance also with the brethren from Highgate and also from Light in the Valley again. And um worked tirelessly all of yesterday in the morning until the night and still back in the house of the Lord. I want to give God thanks. Let's put the hands of Jesus for these men and women who have given off their time and their substance and their skills to the work of the kingdom of God. We want to also let you know those who are in the community, whether you're here in person or online, that the point place that we're directing you is in North Field United Pentecostal Church, right beside the police station. You can't me across from the police station. Amen. And we have services there beyond this 10 crusade. So we want you to remember that that's the point, please. Amen. Amen. At this time, we're going to ask Deacon Patrick Carter from Not For UPC to come and he's going to close us off in prayer at this time, Deacon Carter. Also, we want to acknowledge Amen, Minister Perry and the team from Bonnegate. They came after Precious would have acknowledged. But we're still happy that they came. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord, everybody. Let us all bow our heads everywhere. We're going to pray. In the name of Jesus Christ, we thank you one more time, Lord, for being so very good to us, to bringing us, Lord God Almighty, to this service. And to the hand, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray that your presence, Lord, will continue to be upon us. Oh, God Almighty. And tonight is the very first night. We pray, Lord God Almighty, that there will be a mighty move of you. Oh, God, we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. That souls will come from near and from far. Oh God, and as we are about to leave from here tonight, Lord. We pray that you will go with us. 
Lord God, those that are walking, those that are driving, those from near and those that are from far, we pray in the name of Jesus that you will come down, Lord, and guide us, walk with us, drive with us. In the name of Jesus, cut and clear the way, Lord. Oh, God, we are the enemy. Stand in the name of Jesus Christ. We pray that your blood, Lord God Almighty, will cut and clear the way that there will be deliverance. Cover us with your hand, we pray. In the name of Jesus, we give you glory and honor in Jesus' name. And the church shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Amen. Let's lift our hands and just give the Lord thanks for having been with us tonight, our first night. And I want to give God thanks for his servant, and Minister Don. And when he mentioned earlier that he has gone several years without much of a break, he's really telling the truth. And we give God thanks for him as well. I know Pastor Garfield Malcolm is not here tonight. They are scheduled to come during the week, but I want to express thanks to him, Amen, and the Region 4 Evangelism Committee that he leads as well that has done a lot of work behind the scene to assist with the coordination. So the Lord bless you and keep you and his face shine upon you and give you peace and give you rest. So inviting everyone to come on again tomorrow night. Tell a friend and tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell a neighbor. Amen. Send it in a WhatsApp group. Hallelujah. Let everybody know. Amen. That we are going to be here for a week. Jesus, story. all being well. And they must come on out. Amen. If you want to be baptized, amen, we have put numbers on the screen. It's actually on the poster. Amen. It's also on the stream as well. Amen. Sister Ennis, your number is 9990-7129. That's 876-990-7129. And the other number is 876 806 44 one eight. Amen. God bless you. And if you're in the Northfield area and you 